right, when the action takes place, Trevor Jacob in the black shorts, Danger Dave Clark in the black and red SBG tights. Third man in the cage, referee Bobby Wambacher. This one, don't blink. Yeah, I mean, don't blink. Here's, here's the thing, is Trevor, we saw him, he didn't set up his takedowns in Mississippi. He's got to set his takedowns up against a guy like David Clark, man. You cannot shoot from range three and four because he'll get a flying knee to the, to the dome. Dave Clark coming out measured early. But he always does. He, he's going to throw a lot of feints. But I'm going to tell you, when he strikes, it's precision. Oh, big right hand. Right hand down the pipe and a head kick to boot. Trevor Jacob in trouble early. Yeah, he is. Dave Clark not pouncing too soon. And Chris Connolly in the corner of Dave Clark's hand. The body's open. There we see another another shot. Oh, oh big there Dave Clark. Big but Trevor Jacob Get fighting the, for the single yeah, leg. Dave is doing a good job by defending it. If I was Trevor, I would go with the double right now. David's got the left leg out. Trevor Jacob almost finishing a single leg here yeah, on David Clark. I it's close. Go, I it's really close. I would go with a double right now if you could. David Clark's doing a good job by pushing the head down. The posture of, of David Clark very bad, excuse yeah, me, Trevor Jacob, very bad right now because Dave Clark is pushing on the head, sneaking that left elbow in. I mean, really, David Clark's in a good position right here, yeah, man. He's not great. He, there he goes. Good knee, good elbow. The right hand gets through. But Trevor gonna, Jacob shot. Oh! Oh, right knee lands. And this is almost it. How long can Trevor Jacob stay alive? Referee Dave Bobby Clark looking to finish this fight. Referee Bobby Wambach is Con looking close in this fight. Chris Conley's telling. I think Chris Conley was telling Dave Clark to stand up. Yeah, he was telling him to stay up. Then he just told him to stay there and mount. And I don't blame him. He needs to. Tr Trevor Jacobs doing a good job by keeping his posture down. But you know what, Hacker? Trevor Jacobs ate that flying knee like it was nothing. Yes, he did. David Clark's real methodical. He's a brown, he's a purple belt here. He knows what's up. Trevor Jacobs got to improve his position. There he, he's trying to. But when you got a strong guy with good hips like David Clark does, oh, he almost turned David Clark. But look at the hips that David Clark's got on him, man. David Clark just in complete control of this bout. Trevor Jacobs shelling up. He's got oh, that's back of the head. Right hand control in the hands of Trevor Jacob. Jacob up and out almost. Rear naked choke attempt for and David Clark. I Trevor know. Jacob in all kinds of trouble here. I don't know if it's on. Oh, he, he, he tapped. tapped. And Dave Clark moves to 2 and 0. In Dothan, Alabama. Great performance from Danger Dave Clark. He remains undefeated as a professional. Trevor Jacob came in, gave it all he had. You're not going to find many guys that go very far with David Clark. No, I mean, look, he lasted longer than most. You know what I'm saying? Like, he did a really good job. The thing is, he ate that flying knee, which was very, I mean, I could not believe that he ate that flying knee like he did. And then, with a little bit more training, he will know how to transition from that single to a double and maybe get David down. But David showed he's a true martial artist. And I don't know if Trevor Jacobs' shoulders hurt or not. It looks like he's messing with it. The doctor's messing with his collarbone, his left collarbone. But great job by David Clark. Very dominant. Ooh. The replay there. My goodness. Sorry, Andy. I got excited. I didn't no, it, no, it's good. No, that was that was an amazing replay. It was better than what I was talking about. <laughs> Look at Dave Clark threading the the head, the leg over the arm of Trevor Jacob there. A small detail that we didn't pick up initially. We couldn't see it from where we were sitting. Great stuff from Dave Clark there. You never see anything less than great stuff from Danger Dave Clark. Trevor Jacob drops 0-2. He's still looking for his first victory. We'll see if he, if he will be able to get it one day. But for now, this day belongs to Dave Clark. Let's wrap this up here at Lenscreen. B2 Fighting Series fans, your referee, Bobby Wambacher, has brought a stop to this fight. Two minutes and 24 seconds into round number one. Your winner, by way of tap out due to rear naked choke, Danger Dave Clark! We have the one and only Danger Dave Clark here, winning his second professional fight. How do you feel? I feel, I feel excited. I'm ready for more. Came here to compete. I trained a long time for this, and I'm just glad for opportunity for some competition. So if you're out there, you know, I'm, I'm wide open for you. Just give me a call. Talk to my manager, Eric Anders. Hey, that's my boy. That's all.
How active are you gonna? You're gonna so you're gonna try to really active to yes. stay really active this year. Yes. What goes into being active? Uh, so our culture in our gym is to stay ready. Uh, being a martial artist is a lifestyle. So uh, when it comes to training to be in this level, we train all the time. We don't really believe in camp. Right. Camp is just you know we're toning down and, and honing in on our uh, on our opponent. Well, all through the all through the whole thing, we're just um, training for opportunities to win jujitsu, grappling, striking, all of it. We're a whole ass martial artist. You know what I'm saying? If you're gonna call yourself a type of fighter, what kind of fighter are you? Huh? So I'm a fighter. I, uh, opportunistic fighter. Okay. You know because you know a wise philosopher said, uh, life's like a box of chocolates, and I'm ready to eat all that chocolate. So you know I just try to keep opportunities. And I train that way too. So striking, grappling, all that. Whole ass martial artist. Well, it doesn't look like you eat a lot of box of chocolates. Oh, no, I do. I do. I ain't gonna lie. I train a lot. Chocolate's good. It's a lot of dopamine. Keeps me right. Okay. You know, yeah. What's your favorite type of chocolate? My favorite type of chocolate. Oh, you got me. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> My favorite type of dark chocolate because it made me feel healthy when I eat it. Okay. You know, but I had to have some peanut butter on it for the protein. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And I love that's, peanut butter. That's damn it. You training exactly yeah. it does it does, it does. all right it well okay so last time danger day was actually one of my first ever interviews here at p2 yeah. fighting series so you're like a, a veteran interviewer a vet? oh, what? i mean you are oh, God. so i have something to play would you oh. sing us another tune like you did yes. last time yes yes i got you okay oh, snap. all right here we go you. guys hold on all right do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. You ready? Yeah, uh, yeah. Wait, give me, let me drop it. If I'm gonna do it. Okay, okay, okay. Coming out of my cage and then I'm doing just fine. God, I gotta get down, cause I want it all. Saw that I would kiss, and how they end up like this. It was only a kiss, it was only a kiss. And she could sleep, and she's calling the cab, and he's having a smoke, and he's taking a drag, and it's coming in the bed, and my stomach is sick, and it's all in my head. Okay, y'all wait. It's all in my chest now. Uh, oh, sorry. Okay. You got me. All right. It's peachy right. now. Okay. All right, guys. Dave, you are always spectacular to have in the cage and back here. And thank you so much. Uh, thank you, thank you. It was it was a pleasure. It was a pleasure always. As always. always. Oh, we always do it. <laughs> All right, guys. Danger, Dave. You got it from the man right here.